Okay, so uh, what we got here is what we got here is a, is a, pro is a problem to communicate. And so we got uh, Christian apologetics all over the world uh, being extremely uh, blasphem blasphemous of the Holy Spirit. Right? That's unforgivable. Now, what I need to uh, express in this video is that, um, I mean, we know some of these names, the uh, Karate Jew and whatnot, the Karate Jew and uh, uh, Vocab, Malone, and many, many other people, right? It's a lot of them. Every single one that you see that uh, expresses uh, their uh, psychology, expresses their, uh, what do you call that, when they are addicted to us, right? They're stalking us and <clears throat> they do an, ex an extremely... Uh, loud job of smearing uh every israelite on the planet <clears throat> i don't know why they don't go on a campaign to smear jesus christ which they have done and that's why there's an image of a white jesus christ and uh there are people who write books whole books uh, accusing him of being jesus christ being a homosexual <coughs> Or living some other form of alternative lifestyle. So, what I need you to do is to first understand uh, this verse here. And this is uh, a reason why I'm going to request that you take action against these people. Fight them. Right? So... If they are going to uh, make the claim that Israelites are liars and never prove anything or whatnot, and saying that all Israelites in every camp and every Israelite on the face of the planet, including uh, Jesus Christ, is extremely heretical and wicked, this is a campaign making uh, the case uh that emulates the smear campaign against the Jewishers in Germany uh, during the Third Reich. And you know, we're under a, a, a mock system of that where they are emulating the, the German Third Reich <coughs> smearing the Jewishers that lived there at that time, failing to cite the genocide that happened to the Wasa Wasapi people during uh 1917 okay so they don't they don't they skip over the genocide of the black people right and then they skip straight to the jewisher hoax okay so now when they do, when they do that during that time <sighs> the third reich went on a extreme Smear campaign of showing Jewishers with uh, big noses, big gigantic noses, show caricatures of the Jewishers. This is the same thing that has that happens to black people worldwide today and has continued to happen to black people. Now, the difference between a Jewisher hoax and a uh, uh, black genocide is that black people actually be become genocided just as the native americans were genocided to 97 percent of their population got wiped out so now that our uh punishment is over it's over and time is up the change of guard happens e esau kingdom okay which is the un the united nations nato and all who are confederate against israel their time is up <clears throat> now 
how this uh, goes into effect is the same way that we were placed into the transatlantic slave trade. The Pope of that time, Pope Nicholas V, performed a prophecy. We were prophesied to go into Egypt again on ships. Nicholas V of the Pope seat fulfilled that prophecy. He performed it. Whether he knew he was performing the prophecy according to biblical uh, purpose or not, the fact is he did it. Nicholas V gave permission to Alfonso V of Portugal in order to subject the sons of Sarah, Saracens, according to the promise, to perpetual servitude and to confiscate all of our uh, well-being and hunt us anywhere in the world that we are. Anybody uh, disagrees and, and fights back uh, to just slaughter us all, right? So that's what happened worldwide. And now they think that that conquering counts as an honorable act. This is what they think. So now... <clears throat> The way I read the prophecies is that what I'm doing has no effect, okay? But <clears throat> I believe and know that it's extremely important for people to perform prophecies. So now, here is an uh, issue here that I'm discussing, Exodus 11 and 7. But against any of the children of Israel shall not a dog move his tongue. A dog is a reference to Canaan, Canaanite. Okay, make sure I'm saying that correctly. Okay, but that's that's why they call uh, dogs canines today is because of the Canaanites. So it might not be equal. Yeah, it's Caleb here. But <clears throat> now, not... Uh, let me read that again. Okay. But against any of the children of Israel shall not a dog move his tongue against man or beast that you may know how that the Most High does put a difference between the Egyptians and Israel. Okay. So now the neo egypto bots, Camites, Hamites, the Neo-Hamites who think that they are of Hamitic lineage and don't know one lick of difference between lineage and locational preference. You understand? <clears throat> uh, they do not have this form of protection that has been developed over the years in order to protect us uh, by the law. We can go to any... Uh, channel we choose and report it purposely to to secure this warning here but against any of the children of israel shall not a dog move his tongue against man or beast that you may know that the most high does put a difference between the egyptians and israel so <clears throat> even though me personally i believe that their uh lies are ineffective i uh honest it's ineffective on me personally in changing my my mind and 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 it all it does is give fuel to the growth of and the awareness of the israelite uh understanding of being from that lineage however they always attach it to their uh perverted religions they always detach it from the scriptures and they attach it to their perverted religions our israelite heritage so we are the vanguards and the uh th those who should protect the honor and reputation of the scriptures uh -huh.
that's why we're here. That's why we're uh, uh, multiplying so so rapidly. So now, what I want you to do is to report anybody and Sue, especially Sue, like 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 these guys that get shot by the cops, or like their family sue the cops and win millions of dollars. So what I want you to do is when you see a news organization on mainstream TV or cable on the thousand channel cable network, this is why they have a media blackout on us because they don't want to be sued because they know that if they, if they say the wrong thing, as in every Israelite on earth and all Israelites, then you're going to be sued and I'm going to be the one to, to do it. So now when you see these people on YouTube, Instagram, Snapchat, the book, Facebook, or anywhere in the world, including the, the FBI, the CIA, the NSA, anybody in the world that calls the name of Israel wicked, sue their ass. Sue them, sue them, sue them. Also report these people uh, to whatever platform that they're on saying that all Israelites are wicked. Okay, so that's the same smear campaign that happened to the Jewishers in Germany, which caused the Holocaust hoax. This is the same smear campaign that happened uh, with uh, many other people around the world. They go in, they smear us as usual, or they pick every last one of our uh, entertainers and all kinds of things, you know, that, that, that people kind of esteem. And then they accuse them of something that they didn't do. And then 50% of the time they accuse them of something that they did do. Okay. And then they purposely destroy them on purpose. Well, uh, that has come to an end. What needs to happen is that all these people get reported over and over and over again everywhere that they say our names our names are not to be slung through the mud, mud where we should not have this reputation of uh uh being disgraceful we should not have this reputation at all okay so now they what they should do is call out the name of the person or small group of people two or three people who have done a disgrace. But what they elect to do in their stupidity and their libel is to uh, stereotype every Israelite on the face of the planet. That's illegal. And it's libel. Sue their ass. Sue them. Thanks for listening.